Who in here is interested in obtaining their portion of almost $37 million worth of scholarships? Everybody wants money? $37 million. Uh, what if I were to tell you that obtaining your part of this money is as easy as making good grades and paying a one-time fee? Hmm. Seem interesting? Of the students in here that have received an invitation to Phi Theta Kappa, who has actually joined? You have one? Did anybody else receive letters? You did? Okay. Now, for those of you who haven't joined and have received a letter, or for those of you that haven't received a letter, I want you to all listen closely to what I'm about to tell you. My name is Leanna Cooper, and I am the Vice President of Scholarship on our campus of Phi Theta Kappa. This qualifies me to present this information to you today. I'm also an extremely active member in Phi Theta Kappa. The purpose of this speech is to inform you of the benefits of being a member, whether you're active or not, and to convince you why you should rethink to join Phi Theta Kappa. Phi Theta Kappa will benefit many of you in many different ways. Today I would like to inform you of three different things. One, the membership requirements. Two, scholarship opportunities. And three, the opportunities to travel with Phi Theta Kappa. First, I'm going to talk to you about what is required to become a member of Phi Theta Kappa. To be eligible for membership in Phi Theta Kappa, the student must first obtain a GPA of at least a 3.5 or higher to become a member. After becoming a member, the student must keep a GPA of at least a 3.2. After obtaining this GPA, the eligible member will receive a letter either by email or mail or by word of mouth. Uh, we're actually calling people now also that may not know. And um, they pay a one-time fee, either online, on campus, or by mail, of $80. Now, I know $80 seems like a lot of money to you guys. It was a lot of money to me at the time also. Um, I, I have my own household, and my parents were the parents that told me, hey, if you want to go to school, buy money. So I understand, but whenever you look at the investment that you're making for $80 towards thousands of dollars worth of scholarships, the, the answer is going to be quite simple to you guys. It's, it's definitely worth the money. Um, next, I'm going to inform you of the scholarship opportunity that Phi Theta Kappa will offer you. Uh, how many of you are planning to transfer to a four-year university after this? we got a couple of people in here. Okay, cool. Um, <coughs> did you know just by being a member, just by paying that one-time membership of $80 and not doing anything past that, having that on your transcript will get you scholarships. Um, many of these scholarships also will compile with other scholarships that pertain to your GPA and they'll file on top of each other. Most of the time it will either pay for all tuition or most of your tuition. Uh, for instance, right now at Old Miss, the DPK scholarship combined with the GPA scholarship that you're automatically eligible for by being a member of Phi Theta Kappa is $16,000. They save a lot of money. So. Say you uh, graduate from here, get your two years, and then take a break in between. Does that still count? Still counts as long as you don't enroll anywhere else. When I'm going back to South and I've attended South Creek. That's because you went to South first. Is there any way like around that? Mm, well, you have to come talk to Dr. Sison about that. I can't tell you anything about that. She may know a loophole, but I, I myself do not know that. I know that usually you get your scholarships after your first time attending the university. But um, I think there has been several people that actually have went to South, came here, and then got the PPK scholarships and went back. Then you talk to the recruiters and Dr. Sison combined and they'll <coughs> help you. They're going to do whatever they can for you. Um, another instance, Delta State University and North Mississippi, they've got the number one nursing school in the district now. They've just been voted for that. They pay full tuition, room and board, and books just for being a Phi Theta Kappa member. Um, <clears throat> Southern, Southern gives you $8,000 for PPK, and then you also get other scholarships compiled on top of that. I'm going to the University for uh, Mississippi University for Women. They're the number one nursing school in the state. I, um, I've got $6,000 for PPK and $5,000 for presidential on top of that, and then all of my Pell Grants and all that stack on top of it. So there's a lot of money that you got. Um, another thing that they offer in scholarship-wise is there's a fall and spring common application on PPK.org. Uh, right now, the spring common application is open. There's actually medical scholarships on there. There's nursing scholarships. There's leadership scholarships. There's uh, academic team scholarships, which a lot of these universities, if you make it to the academic team, uh, they give you a scholarship just for being an all-state or national academic team member, too. Um, 
what you do is you go online with your profile, you put in one application with one essay, and it puts you in for all of these scholarships at once. So it's, instead of filling out 30 different applications, you fill out one, and it goes in for all of these. Some of these scholarships are up to like $20,000, $30,000, you guys. We had somebody win one last year. She was, we went to a national convention, and she was a celebrity, okay? She got medals for it. She got to walk on stage in front of like 4,000 people that were there. We were in the middle of Disney World. Her pictures were posted on the side of the Swan and Dolphin, which is the five-star resort they have in Disney World. So it's a big thing. Uh, she was a Heisman Scholar winner. Um, another thing that I was going to tell you about today was the amazing opportunities that Phi Theta Kappa will offer you to travel. Um, if you become a member and you become active, Phi Theta Kappa, like on our campus, will take you to different universities for tour. Uh, last year, they went to Old Miss. I got to go to Old Miss with them. Old Miss paid for our hotel rooms, our food and everything. We got to tour their campuses and we got to do a lot of other fun stuff around there. Um, I've been to Jackson State University, which also offers full tuition for Phi Theta Kappa members for any business majors or anything like that. Um, <clears throat> I've been to JCJC, so uh, that's a junior college also, but it was a big campus, that was a big junior college. I've been to the Mississippi University for Women. I've been to Mississippi State University. I've been all kinds of university campuses. Uh, additionally, we go to regional and national convention. Uh, they just got back from regional convention and went to LSU for regionals. Um, <clears throat> national convention last year, we went to Disney World. Uh, we stayed in the Swan and Dolphin for five days in Disney World and we got cheap park tickets for one night. Um, while I was at National Convention, I got to hear from a Holocaust survivor. I got to listen to the guy who discovered the Titanic speak, and I also got to meet a lady that climbed to the tip of Mount Everest and she skied to the North and South Pole. So we get to meet a lot of cool people at these places. Um, this year's speaker, I'm trying to remember, John Legend is coming this year to Nationals, which it's going to be in, um, we're going to, Texas. We're going to San Antonio. <clears throat> uh, another opportunity you get with Phi Theta Kappa to travel. I just got my scholarship approved. Uh, um, they have a program called the International Scholar Lariat Program. They send these letters out and depending upon your major and what you're majoring in, they send you to different countries to study. Um, I got a choice between South Africa and Australia. So I'm going to Australia for 14 days. I'm gonna to get to see the Sydney Opera House. I'm gonna to get to go to the University of Sydney and do their medical museum. I get to go see the Great Barrier Reef. Um, and I'm also going to learn about Aboriginal medicine, uh, the culture over there. I get to learn about midwifery while I'm over there. There's all kinds of stuff. And all of this is paid for, except for my passport and my plane ticket, which is a lot of money, okay? I mean, uh, a lot of money, you guys. And they pay for one of my flights connecting between two of the cities. So it's, it's pretty cool. Uh, another one of my friends is going to China. Uh, and then I also have another friend that's going to South Africa. And then we've got a friend that's going to England. He's actually going to stay in Cambridge University, I believe. He's going to Cambridge, which is, I don't know if any Harry Potter fans, but that's where they filmed all of the Harry Potter movies, like for the dining hall and all that. So it's pretty cool. Um, in conclusion, I would like to remind you the purpose of this speech was to inform you of the benefits of joining Phi Theta Kappa, the requirements to join Phi Theta Kappa, and the benefits of travel for Phi Theta Kappa. <clears throat> Again, I'm qualified to present this information to you because I am the Vice President of Scholarship on this campus at this point in time, and I'm a very active member also. I applaud those of you that have joined Phi Theta Kappa, and for those of you that haven't, the next time you get an invitation in the mail, I hope that you reconsider paying that eighty dollars because it's a big thing, you guys. And once you leave this campus, you can't join anymore. It's over with. And a lot of the honor societies for four-year universities, you guys, you don't pay a one-time membership. You pay a membership every year to stay in this organization. Okay, and, and it's quite costly. I know that I was looking at one for a four-year university. It's like one hundred and sixty dollars a year, you guys. It's expensive. <clears throat> um, Phi Theta Kappa currently contains over two million members in over 1,250 chapters worldwide. There's people all over the world that are in PTK. It is now considered one of the largest honor societies in the entire world. I hope the information that I have provided to you guys has convinced you to possibly rethink joining this honor society. <coughs> Any questions for me? How? I'm sorry, Mark.
<laughs> what? Your PowerPoint's not working. Uh, I'm at, the computer hates me. It's no time. <laughs> it was working before I sat down. I worked through the bugs and it was working through it. And then I got up over there to press the button. It was like, nope. Nope, <laughs> Nothing. Nobody wants to know anything. I know some different scholarships for different universities. Or if you need to know scholarships for universities regarding PPK, you can always come talk to me. Um, I'm always on campus. I've been here since. Oh, scholarships like a drawing, or is it more of a? No, the the. Are you talking about the university scholarships? Yes. Mm -mm. Um, as long as your transcript reads that you're a PPK member, you get it. Uh, there's no drawing. Like how much would it be, say, for you? Uh, University of Southern Mississippi, if you were to transfer as a Phi Theta Kappa member, they offer $8,000 for two years. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Um, Southern, like I said, uh, that's Southern. Let's see. State is offering uh, a total of $16,000 for two years, and so is Old Miss. USA? Uh, no, that's Mississippi State and uh, mm -hmm. Old Miss. And USA. I think USA offers right now, I want to say about $4,000, plus on top of that, they waive your out-of-state fee, mm -hmm. and then their engineering department right now has a massive scholarship for PPK members. It's, um, I want to say one of our members transferred over there, she got like $16,000 for two years, plus they gave her a free laptop and they paid for her room and board. What well, if you're kind of in, it, in, a, in that state, it's still $4,000? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then there if you go on their website also, they have specific PPK scholarships that you apply for for like drawings too. But those are your guarantee to get right. as long as you're a PPK member. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you have any contact information you could give the class or as to how they can get in touch with you. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, I'm busy. You can go ahead. Well, I was itching. Oh, okay. Um, uh, if y'all got a pen and piece of paper, I can give y'all my email address and my phone number right now. Uh We all just received a really big award too this this year, you guys. The officer team that's on campus right now, uh, we just got recognized as a distinguished chapter in the entire nation. So they're paying for us to go to San Antonio, they're giving us medals, taking pictures, putting us in the paper. So it's it's pretty cool, you guys. Um, we did community service. Uh, we went to Boche Elementary about three weeks ago and read to the elementary students for Dr. Seuss Day. Uh, we did beach cleanups. Um, ORL events, we had a ropes course for everybody for leadership. Uh, there's all kinds of stuff we do, so if y'all want to get involved, you come and let us know. Y'all missed orientation. We are not orientation, induction. We had induction a week and a half ago. However, it was right before spring break, we had induction. But you can still become a member. The, you can become a member up to the day before you graduate here. So as long as that's on your transcript, you guys, you know, do it. I'm telling you, because it's worth it. It's paying for my school. 